What's this surprise about? Just be patient, Mom. There's only about 20 steps left. Is everything ready? Yes, miss. Come right in. Okay, Mom. We're here. Careful. Have a seat. I'm uncovering your eyes. Surprise! <gasps> but I can't believe it. Welcome to the Lael Theater. <laughs> My darlings, this is so beautiful. I hope that you enjoy it. Thank you for your help. <laughs> <laughs> Just like on the island, when we used to go to the movies. Mm -hmm. Every week. When Dad used to be at work, you, Celine, sometimes the neighbors. <sighs> so tell me, which one of you thought this up? Celine. Celine, my darling girl. I thought you'd like to reminisce a little bit tonight. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so what are we watching? It's your favorite movie. Mm -hmm. Actually, I have a surprise for you both. I didn't tell Celine. I found an old video. I think you'll like it. What video is it? Let's watch it first. It's a surprise. Watch and see. Mm. My darlings. Mm. Mm. My darlings. <sighs> I'll find a job as soon as I get there. You don't have to worry, because nothing will change for you. I'll send whatever I earn, just like before. It's just that it might be difficult for Sarah to keep taking private lessons at the study center. I don't know when I'll find a job or how much I'll even be earning. But Anna, I know that things will be hard for you. But try to understand. There's nothing else I can do. Mom is right. <laughs> You are selfish. You think only of yourself. Are you really saying that? You'd study if you actually wanted to? Does anything change when I send you to the study center for private lessons? Does anything make you study? What will change if you don't go? <laughs> Mom, take this money. It'll keep you going for a while. But what will happen when this money runs out? Mom, I already told you that I'm going to be finding a new job. Do you think it's easy to find a job? People look and look and they still can't find a job. But that's not going to happen, Mom. I will find a job and so will Kareem. You know, it would help if, if you found a job as well. Not to work every day, but maybe part-time. How do you expect me to work at this age, huh? Do you think I don't work because I don't want to? I can't lift anything anymore. I'm always in such pain, Anna. Mom, you know that I'd stay here if I could. And I wouldn't ask you to work if I didn't have to. Please try and understand me. I'm doing the best that I can. You ruin our lives because of him and then tell me to understand. Well, no, I don't understand you. I refuse to understand Fine you. Fine then, Mom, don't. <laughs> Celine, I'm coming, Mommy. Tell me, what do you want to be when you're all grown up? Mm, I'll be a doctor, like Daddy. Mm, I'll help sick people get better, and I'll travel around the world. Oh. Daddy! No, he's my dad! He's Daddy. No, he's mine! I'm your father, and yours too. <laughs> Don't be like that. I thought that you'd both be happy. <laughs> Look at you. <sighs> Ken, you're so mean. You made us cry. Didn't you like it, Mom? <laughs> when you're young, you never think that your loved ones will die. You think everything will remain the same. That you'll be happy and together.
We wanted this to be a beautiful night for you. We didn't do all this to make you unhappy. <laughs> Excuse me a moment. When I suddenly saw your father in front of me, I... I'm changing this mood right now. Here comes the movie we should be watching. If you please. Thank God I chose a comedy. <sighs> You look so much like your father. Oh, Mom. Fine, I'll keep quiet. <laughs> See you around. Look after yourself. I'll call you every chance I get. I'm going to miss you. When are we going to see you again? I don't know. Let me sort things out. You can always visit even if I can't. I'm really going to miss you. Goodbye, Mom. Let's get going. Come on. Anna told us to. I'm not going anywhere. But Anna told us to. She's nothing to us. She's not my daughter anymore. I wish that I'd never given birth to her. 